guys, welcome to Nento Twin 22. Vanessa here speaking, and today we have another unboxing video. And this time we gonna see um, or review with regards to Blythe stand that we usually see online. And actually, I got inspired by an Instagram artist wherein she uses this stand that I just bought. Um, on taking pictures or videos with regards to her Blythe dolls, okay? Anyway, um, before I have this certain stand, I use actually Ever After High stand and it works perfectly well, to be honest. But I'm worried that if this doll uses this stand, the doll might fall so i will demonstrate on how i use this okay and yeah i will just make you see the picture that i took um using this stand okay so i will demonstrate to you on how i attach this so actually this has three parts for the ever after high doll so we have this base and we have this long plastic and this one for the neck um if you're gonna use it for your blast doll so <laughs> there yeah we will attach this one like this and then attach also the stand just like that and then on how to make your Blythe doll stand, you just have to place this on her neck. I don't know if you can see. That's how I use it. And make sure that it's just right. Wow, it's exactly... That's why I'm so worried. It's just good for that. <laughs> but I'm so worried if she accidentally fall. <laughs> That's why I bought another stand to secure. Anyway, this um, ever after high stand can work. I'm not sure if um, the rest of the stands can work, the ordinary one but so far this works well and ever after high um stance is also kind of similar to the stand of the monster high dolls but i really like the stand of the ever after high better i'm my style is not a gothic style okay <laughs> that's why i really like this this stand because if it has a good design okay and yeah this works perfectly well, but I'm just worried if she accidentally knock off. So yeah, that's the issue here. Anyway, we're gonna check your new stand. <laughs> Alright, so I will just place her here. While she was waiting for her stand. Okay, so... We're gonna unbox now her new stand. And actually, I also ordered extra hands for her. I just received this today. So, whenever I receive an item from Shopee, I unbox it right away because I need to um, post a review about it on... On the rate okay so people will be aware if this is a good quality or not if it works let's see so here it is Ooh, sorry about the noise I know that it sounds annoying so yeah oops what I ordered is free hands at the same time the stand all together so nothing else so 
and just remove the box. Sorry about that. There's a hole there. <laughs> anyway, so here it is. Hmm. There's a stapler. Staple wire. <laughs> stapler. <laughs> Staple wire. Okay. You remove the staple and yeah these are the ones that I ordered I hope that it matches her skin tone I believe so it matches <laughs> oh, she looks lighter actually I ordered the white because her body is white skin okay I will show this to you first the hands extra hands for for the doll so I got A and B white skin okay that's what I ordered and this one is kind of feels like a rubber <laughs> to be honest but good quality to be honest so yeah hmm I was surprised so this is another set of um, set of arms <laughs> or hands sorry so for the first set we got this two <laughs> I don't know if you can see peace sign Um, <laughs> look at this. I don't know if you can see. Look at that. The details. This is the back. Oh dear. It, <laughs> it can't it can focus. Really sorry about my camera. It's bad. <laughs> All right, so here is the closed fist. It's funny. They all look the same. Oh, this one is different. This one is kind of like this. Okay, this... These two. I'll make you see... Come on, focus, see? They are different. But both are closed fist. But the other. The other one looks like holding something, but no. There's no holes. I don't know if you can see. Doesn't focus, see, there's no holes. Even here. Because they might focus on the doll's face. Okay. The camera might focus on it. <laughs> so I hope that you get the details of the extra hands. So for the next set, we got this set of hands thumbs up <laughs> thumbs down <laughs> really nice set of hands very detailed actually and this one is for the holding holding of stuff Really detailed, so I think that I need to <laughs> make you see this again because I know that it's not that clear. Here you go. So, yeah, that is a set of hands. Anyway, I will just check this if it's really like this. Like, I have two, two sets that are missing. I don't know if this is normal. 
Okay, better check the comment section as well for whatever they got. Anyway, let's now check the stand. So this is the stand itself. So this is for the base. Actually, it moves movable. And if you move it, obviously the top portion will move as well. And we also have this set of rubbers to hold your base, to hold this, okay, because I don't know if you can see, there's also plastic, uh, not plastic, rubber, rubber stuff, <laughs> transparent rubber for the base. It's already attached so you can see here these are just extras so for an extra um, they gave four four extra rubbers for your stand and yeah they also place rubbers for the top portion and also to the base now we will test the stand if it works well with the blind style. So, based on um, the pictures that the vendor has, it works this way. So, this is um, the back of my doll. And it's convenient if your, your doll has short hair. So, this is challenging actually. So, just put it that, like this. Put it on the hole. And then, <laughs> make her start. <laughs> Lucky you're wearing a headband. So, as well I guess but look at her <laughs> looks like she's having a hard time to stand <laughs> oh dear I don't know why if this is normal <laughs> But, see, she can't really stand. There you go. <laughs> but the way she stands is awkward. I think that using the monster, not monster, the ever after high is better. Because this worries me. I wonder if it works if she is seated. Oh dear, it was removed from her. This is not bendable, guys, okay? So you can't use this to make her sit down. Okay, once again, let's try again. Place it on this hole. And let's make her stand again using the stand. I think the ever after stand is better. And this really worries me a lot because she looks like she's holding a grudge <laughs> while, making, while I'm making her stand. It doesn't work. I see the front. <laughs> Look at that. She's unhappy <laughs> about the result. You don't like the stand? 
I make you see the difference between that stand and the ever after high stand. That doesn't work. It's hard to use. So here it is. She's more comfortable using this. But I think with regards to the stick, um, the one that I just bought, I think that we just need to work on it probably. Oops, I'm just adjusting. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, there you go. This is how she stands. Using... Actually... You can adjust. At least she's standing tall. Unlike the other stand. If I display my doll, see, this is what worries me. I don't want her to fall. That's why I bought her a new stand. And sad that this doesn't work at all. To be honest, this doesn't work. So. Anyway. Just tried and tried. <laughs> Yet it didn't work. See, <laughs> it should be sliding like that, <laughs> and this is how it looks like on the front view. Oopsie! Now my doll is sad. She closed her eyes. <laughs> okay. So, it's really up to you which works well, but for me, this one really is freaky. It made my heart pump <laughs> with nervousness, okay? So, anyway, I hope that you may find this unboxing video helpful with regards to the stance and the extra hands. And anyway, thank you for watching and sending you all peace, love, and light. Bye.